Did you know that nuclear explosions created dozens of craters on the planet, and some of them have become lakes? This one's in Nevada. It's called Sedan Crater. In 1962, the U.S. detonated a 104 kiloton bomb here as part of Project Plowshare, which was nearly five times more powerful than the one dropped on Hiroshima. The resulting crater is 390 meters wide and 100 meters deep. There's no water, but radiation levels are still high. During the Cold War, both the U.S. and the USSR tested nuclear energy for so-called peaceful purposes, building canals, mining, and even farming. In Kazakhstan, on former Soviet land, there's another lake, Lake Chagan. The Soviets set off a 140 kiloton underground bomb to make a reservoir for farming. The crater, 400 meters wide, was filled with water from the nearby Shagan River. That's how the lake formed, radioactive but full of life. Locals even bring their livestock to drink here, believing that clear water means clean water. So, should nuclear technology ever be used to make lakes?